Hey there, friend. Can I copy your homework? Of course you can. Just make it look a bit different so it doesn't look like you just copied it. No problem. Stepping into the cartoony world of Cuphead is an experience like no other. With an extremely heavy inspiration in cartoons from the 30s along with traditional hands-drawn animation, it really feels like you're traveling back in time to a golden age of cartoons. Cuphead is one of the most well-known indie games of the last few years, and it's gotten big enough to warrant a full animated series on Netflix coming soon. When a franchise like this gets super popular and makes a ton of money, it's only inevitable that other companies will come along and try to do the same thing. This time around, we're dealing with a game called Enchanted portals. The opening animation in the trailer is innocent enough. It clearly draws inspiration from 30s cartoons as these two wizards cast some sort of spell resulting in a magic portal. They get sucked in and the gameplay is finally revealed, which immediately caught the internet's attention, not necessarily for the best reasons. Enchanted Portals is getting backlash for directly copying everything that made Cuphead so special. From the style to the shoot 'em up genre, this game isn't trying to hide that it's heavily inspired by the popular indie game. Instead of the finger shooting like we see in Cuphead, this time it's magic wands! Oh, you guys, it's different because it's magic wands! No, it's really the same thing. The way these wizards jump feels awfully familiar. They can even dash like everyone's favorite sentient cup. After watching just a few seconds of the trailer, it's safe to say that we're dealing with a full-on ripoff, and just how bad is that really? Well, it's bad. But at the same time, you can tell there is some effort thrown into this. In fact, its quality seems much higher than the average video game or cartoon ripoff. While while the core mechanics and style of Enchanted Portals is just like Cuphead, there are still some different aspects like the bosses themselves. Each of them will have their own abilities and designs that are separate from the previous game, so hey, at least there's that. From the trailer, some of them legitimately look really fun to face. Like for example, can we please talk about this robot cow? The concept is so cool, look at it! Not only that, but the animation looks relatively clean and easy on the eyes. It's not nearly as smooth as Cuphead's, but you can still tell they actually tried with bringing the 30s animation to life. Now, even though the game looks promising in some ways, it's still gonna be looked at as just a Cuphead ripoff. Because of that simple fact, I'm not sure if this is gonna end up doing well on the Kickstarter. When you make the internet mad, they're pretty unforgiving until things change. Here's Zizo Game Studios' response to the criticism. Yes, of course Cuphead was a huge inspiration for Enchanted Portals. We're both avid fans and we wanted to make something similar, but always from a place of respect and admiration for the original. We were prepared for some backlash, but the trailer definitely reached way more people than we could ever anticipate, and all the hate and negativity coming our way has definitely had a huge impact on us. You know, I think the best case scenario here is if the game is slightly changed over time to be more of its own thing. Remove some abilities, add some new ones, change some of the clear ripoff mechanics, just do whatever it takes to set the game apart from Cuphead. Since this is about to be put on Kickstarter, there's a good chance it isn't finished yet. That's why I'm saying, if the team spends a bit more time on Enchanted Portals to make it more unique over the next few years, then I think it'd be a lot easier to support this game. But do you think it's a Cuphead ripoff, and how should the company proceed after getting all this backlash? Let's talk in the comments. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and come up below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.